Hello and welcome to my coffee break. You know it's called coffee break because for me it's a coffee break. Ah, coffee, I like coffee. Well, um, if I look down every now and then, that's because I've got a remote control here to see what I'm doing and I'm doing good or bad. And I have uh, some notes here in order not to miss a, an important point I, I want to tell you. Um, first, this video is called Coffee Break 4, although it's my first coffee break in English because it's in sync with the numbering of my German coffee break videos. And I'm a totally lazy guy. I hate additional complexity, so I decided to start with number four and be in sync with the other ones. I hope you can cope with that. So what is uh, my coffee break about? What's the concept? The concept is to have a video about my channel, my plans, what went well, what went wrong, um, what is my perception, what are my plans, and most of it totally uncut, so um, it's just me, pure, without a picture, without a video, just my plans, comments, my thank you to you, and things like that. Thank you is a good point, and my first I would like to address, thank you for appreciating my videos in English. I received so many nice and encouraging comments, I'm totally pleased about that, and even more, there is a, a really kind of personal contact and exchange in the comments. I really do like and I would like encourage all of you to use it and I really try to respond and to respond in detail and as soon as I can. So use the comment section and get in contact with me and have an exchange, exchange ideas and things like that. I really love it. If you do love my channel feel free to subscribe if not yet done, share it with other people. Um, spread the message and this is the way you can support my channel. Very, very much appreciated. Oh, you can hear the phone ringing. I hope it doesn't disturb too much on my office and I hope it's not too loud. Um, secondly, I would like to share some plans with you for the future and I got in contact with a very nice lady from a German case making specialist. It's the Eckler GmbH, Eckler Limited. Lisa Eckler, you may know the Archimedes which I've presented at least on my German channel. And uh, the contact remained intact and we had a phone call any two weeks and out of that we, we agreed uh, that's not a cooperation, it's an opportunity for me to receive three watches of the Archimedes brand. Um, Oh, in German Archimede, and three watches of the Limes brand. Not very familiar, not very well known, but really great watches from a case-making specialist with a long history. Very interesting. Limes, for example, has a diver chronograph with a water resistance of 1000 meter at a current price tag of below 2000 euro. Amazing. This particular watch I'm not going to show you because there are other watches which I believe are even more interesting than this one. So two brands which I think have many surprises and I'm really happy to share it with you. Um, the other focus I would like to put on my channel over the next nearer future is De facto. De facto is another really interesting German watchmaking company and the owner is Raphael Eckler. He's the brother of Lisa Eckler, but they are not related in terms of business and companies. It's a completely independent company, an independent brand with very puristic and simplistic watches, easy to read, interesting. I really look forward to it and I hope so do you. The other one, oh, I'm getting, a, sorry, I, I need another coffee, so as I said, coffee is my thing. So the other brand I would like to introduce to you, and this is probably better known than um, Archimedo or Limes, it's Damasco. I think Damasco is a really, really, really interesting watch brand with interesting watches. And depending on, on how we, we agree and how we get into contact, 
compare it to some zins. It might be very interesting. I haven't established the contact yet, but I'm working on that. And that's my plans for the near future. So these are the four brands my current focus is on, and I do hope you like it. If you would like to see other watch brands and have other ideas, leave it in the comments. I'm happy to have an exchange with you. My personal focus would be on watch brands which are not so well known. If you talk about Nomos or Stova, you can find a lot of videos on YouTube, both in German and in English. You find a lot of reviews on, on what you seek and, and others. I would like to produce videos about watch brands and watchmakers which are not so well known, but are still prepared to surprise you. And that is what I would like to do. If you like that idea, leave a comment in the section and I'll adjust my channel according to what you want to see and according to what I want to make. In that sense, thanks for being here and see you on my next video.